नमस्कार व्यूअर्स माय नेम इज दिवाकर एंड इट्स एन अपडेट वीडियो ऑफ माय वीरन स्ट्राइकर्स व्हिच इज आल्सो नोन एज पेलिकन इन हिंदी सो दिस इज माय ट्री सो इट इज बीन ग्रोइंग इन अ वेरी स्मॉल पॉट सो दिस इज द पॉट इन व्हिच आई हैव बीन ग्रोइंग इट्स एन अपडेट वीडियो एंड दिस ट्री इज विद मी फॉर मोर देन 5 एंड अ हाफ इयर्स नाउ सो लेट मी जस्ट शो यू हाउ डज इट लुक लाइक इन द 360 व्यू सो दिस इज द साइड ऑफ द ट्री एंड दिस इज द बैक and this is how it looks like from the front so in my previous video i mentioned like how i how i was able to uh, get this tree generally the trees which i grow they i generally get them uh, for free from my neighborhood so like this tree was growing in the crack of a wall and this portion which you could see like this was the part of the root and so it was growing in the l shape like this so this was the root and this portion was growing uh, vertical uh, to the ground and this portion was horizontal so i removed all the roots from here and i placed it over this spot and the roots beneath this they were able to support it and now it has been growing pretty much fine so like this this root and these roots these are the supporting roots which have grown uh, afterwards so in my previous video you would have seen that my tree had two branches this one and this one and this i trimmed uh, in that video also but now you could see like it has three branches so at present i am trying to convert this trunk and this branch as as the as the main trunk and now it has three branches so this one and this one are the first and second and this one is the third and i have been able to reduce the leaf size uh, of this uh, bonsai tree and i just want to show you one more thing like in my previous video i mentioned that i have uh, trimmed the stem of my microcarpa uh, multi trunk bonsai so this is the this was the stem which i uh, trimmed and you could see like in last 8 days i have been able to develop the roots like the white one the white thread you which you could see these are the roots i did not do much i just kept them in a container i'll show you so this is the container which i have kept i just keep removing the water or changing the water in every 2 to 3 days and i have been able to uh, develop the roots so viewers let me just show you how does it look like uh, from the top so this is the top view of my uh, tree and one more thing i just want to mention like my tree has been able to grow the surface root these red ones these are the surface roots and which you could see like these roots they are generally developed when your tree wants to have more nutrition uh, from the soil so it develops the uh, develop the surface roots so what will they do like they will get thicken with the passage of time and they will turn brown and you would see like uh, it it would uh, like it would look like as if it is the part of the nibari of the tree so like this portion is also technically i can say like it is the uh, nibari of my tree and from here like uh, the roots have been growing and my this tree has been able to grow uh, two aerial roots though they are very small in size but i believe like in couple of uh, months it will be able to develop so like here are the few uh, aerial roots uh, which you could see and i believe like within couple of months they'll be able to penetrate in the soil and they will after that they'll be able to take a good care of themselves so this is the tree and pelican tree is one of the hardest tree uh, uh, which you can uh, start with as a bonsai these trees uh, they are very forgiving uh, and if you like trim them or prune prune them heavily maybe the stem or maybe the roots they recover easily but you just need to take take care a uh, little bit more try to keep them indoors when you have trimmed them or when you have trimmed the uh, roots and they can grow very easily uh, from the cutting when you are doing so just uh, place them in the soil keep the soil moist always and and keep them at the place uh, where they do not receive the direct sunlight but now my tree has attained the health as of now so i just keep it in the direct sunlight because these trees they thrive uh, pretty well in the in the uh, humid and hot climate and they love the sun so if possible when your tree has like survived or it has developed the roots and 
like has been able to develop the branches and the leaves then please keep your tree in the direct sunlight ensure that you keep the soil moist like if like once in a while if you have over watered your tree need not to worry these trees they are pretty hardy they'll survive easily and if you want to prune them and by any chance you want to prune them heavily they can still survive but ensure that when you prune them heavily like maybe the roots or maybe the stem try to keep them in the uh, at a shady place and keep the soil moist and if required just spray the water on the tree so that it is been able to maintain the moisture so viewers if you have liked my video please uh, share it with your friends let me just show you how does my tree look like from the distance so this is the tree uh, how it looks like from the distance and viewers a request uh, please subscribe my channel and because it will motivate me to prepare more videos thanks for now cheers bye